two weeks of heavy bombardment have damaged critical water and sanitation facilities and brought down electrical power lines that are essential in order to operate these facilities. 70% of the population are currently at risk of not being able to access safe drinking water. There's over 800,000 people who are at risk right now of contamination from the seepage of sewa broken sewage lines into the water system. UNICEF is responding to the urgent water and sanitation needs here in Gaza in multiple ways. One is through providing vouchers to families who are currently homeless in order for them to be able to access water and hygiene products at local stores. We are also in the process of distributing hygiene kits for both adults and families as well as babies through our partner, the Palestinian Red Crescent Society, in those shelters, in public schools um, where people are gathering uh, who, who are displaced at the moment.